So last week we did the blonde lion hunt, and if you didn't watch that, basically we streamed for Hunga on Monday, I think. And then, since it was multiplayer, wiped out a huge chunk of this map's population, and then came back to see if any rare lions or diamond lions had spawned, and that's all I've hunted for, so I don't know what else is on this map. Uh, Verhunga likes to spawn diamonds, so I figured we should check it out, because there might be something good waiting for us. And that was even a gold, because... Kudu. Doesn't have to be very impressive, but... 801 for that. And we got to use the 30-odd-6 being ethical for them now. Alright, we got all kinds of stuff at this lake. There's a bunch of warthogs moving through. That's the four I saw, so let's get that. That's another... Uh, new 30 odd 6 thing, so might as well get to use that since it's at least kind of new. That's been a thing for a while, actually. And I didn't really see any interesting chems buck in that little herd there. Doesn't really look like it's worth waiting, so we'll probably go up and around because we can't see anything that's up here, and there tends to be animals there anyway. But yeah, as has been the theme of the classic videos recently, I'm just trying to do stuff like differently than I normally do because it's been working in classic and. I expect it would probably work in Call of the Wild too. It's just a matter of like, you kind of, at least I tend to do the exact same like path over and over again. And while it does tend to work sometimes, or at least the reason I do is because it worked in the past, there's going to be places I miss. So starting here, I never do that. Worked out with a decent little gold there anyway. Not looking like too much interesting. I think that might be our best thing to go for. It actually wasn't brain. Huh. Well, it's gonna die now. I mean, maybe that's a little above the brain? It's gotta be close, but I, I did actually think that if I missed it, I could get into a lung, and clearly that's not even close to the case, but this was a decent little spot. Anyway, we'll try probably just right over here now. There's no lack of Gimsbuck here. There's just not anything super huge looking. I'm actually just thinking, I didn't hunt any Cape Buffalo in that stream. I assume if some got shot, I didn't really pay too close attention, but... That might be something that's actually interesting to go hunt, because it's actually been a while in general since I've hunted them. I didn't think that could make gold. I hear... A lion. It sounds close. It is a male. I can pretty much guarantee this is a line that I did not see in the uh, video where we, uh, you know, came back here after the stream. So I want to get his tracks anyway. If we can get the serve veg or if he's heavy, we'll definitely go for it. Yeah, he's a seven anyway. I had his weight, so I knew he couldn't be huge. Shot a little low on that. Thank you for saving my gold. If he would have actually fled, there is no chance. But, uh, yeah. Now that we have him down. I don't know, I almost want to hunt through here. Wait a second. I just saw... There's another lion. Another seven. Go figure. Alright, let's make a better shot. This time. But yeah, I assume... Because that call I got was chasing, there's gotta be something else out here. Is this a lion place I never knew about? In case you're curious where I'm at, it's like northwest of that lake. I might actually check this out. If it's like a good feed area, then this could be a really good place to grind for a rare one. So obviously gold there. Actually, they'll both make gold because we had good hits. I might actually explore this a little bit. This is entirely not what I planned on doing. That was the one species I kind of planned to ignore, but... It's kind of one of the things I want most from this map. But anyway, what I was getting at, the plan was going to be to go uh, up to one of the Cape Buffalo Lakes, shoot whatever games buck are there, and then change the time. But I think at least for a little bit, we'll probably just keep playing around with this, because I'm very interested. I've maybe never been here, to be honest. Even, you know, not even with lines, just in general. That's actually kind of cool. So, I don't actually know if they only chase, like, when they're feeding. I think early morning is their feed time, but I'm not certain. I just like to find the zone that they're using, just so I can come back to this, but... I don't really know how when they're chasing stuff away. Or I can just 
come upon it by accident. That works too. That's going to be it right there. And where is it actually? Yeah, right down there. And it is uh, midnight to 8.30. That's a long feed range. Oh, hello. Welcome back. Glad you could make it. I help. <laughs> or I steal your kill. It'd be really cool if they actually... I don't know if that's a thing. Would a lion in real life attempt to attack you if you were to steal its kill like that? Or would they just go pounce on it? I don't know. Anyway, that was actually good to find that. I'll run around here a little more in case there's other lions. But otherwise, we'll go check the Cape Buffalo spot. Alright, so I thought we'd just go straight to Cape Buffalo because it didn't seem like there was much else there. It got a lot thicker. Uh, so if there even were lions there, I don't know that I could have seen them. And we've shot against Bucks, so I figured we'd just go straight to Cape Buffalo time because I want to check here and then go up to this little spot because this has been a really, really good area uh, lately. But we'll see if we can get hopefully at least that seven that's down here. So if we can just get him to go alert like that. And you want to give me a brain shot? Thank you. I don't know if there was anything better here, but didn't look like it. Well, there's that. I only have two shots loaded, but... Two uh, broadside shots work pretty good. I was just noticing when I heard that, there's actually more standing over there. Uh, yeah, it's not all that interesting, so I think we'll just go uh, over that spot we were just looking at. Did I get lucky, or... No, nah, it was just two. Two double lungs. I thought maybe we got vertebrae there, or something added to it. Maybe even spinal cord. Okay, that one maybe we'll go for, since it is the max weight estimate. Just in case there's any truth to that uh, theory that ones that have, like, the max weight estimate have a chance at diamond respawns. I really don't know... That's just entirely like a, a theory about the way the game could work. Just about had that. I wonder could we just go for two broadside shots again? I never do that long range. Might not be the best time to try it on the best buffalo we've seen. Can you go alert again? Please? Please? There you go. Eh, I missed it anyway. We'll just make sure he dies for the respawn side of things. Or attempt to make sure he dies. I don't know if that's actually gonna get him. It should. And it did. So... What? Apparently I missed the first shot entirely. I just didn't... I don't know how that could have happened, but... Anyway. Alright, so this guy's finally back. And instead of trying the uh, the alert shot again, because that didn't work, we're going to try this. So I saw this guy spook. I've just been sitting in the tripod. Well, that worked way better. <laughs> I guess I'm going to not alert him from now on, at least the rest of this video. And we might actually go get that one, because that's kind of neat. We'll grab this along the way. He looks decent. I don't know. Yeah, 82. Smaller end mythical, I think. Did that actually work? Now he's just fleeing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I was hoping I could get the the same shots as before. How's that only body? I don't understand this game sometimes. Ow! Something got him there. And now, this probably isn't, a, I'm nearly dead. I don't, are all these charging? The one that I wanted to charge doesn't. <laughs> Everything else does. Can you die, please? Please. Ah, oh, jeez. That might be a seven? <gasps> Ow. <sighs> Died and still got me. There we go. That's a little better. You're a seven. Missed your brain. 
Do you have a brain? I actually did kind of wonder about that, if that could be a thing, because the wildebeest had that problem for a while. Okay. I'm just happy I survived that and didn't have to run all the way back down here. Well, we got one gold out of it. I think that'll be the only one. Because, yeah, we put six shots into seven. And then the red-brown one, I guess one of those fleeing shots that just happened to get lung. Like, I really don't understand. The angle was significantly worse, I thought. But maybe I just sort of got lucky with the placement. So yeah, that was too far forward. Yeah, yeah. Pretty much just caught the outside of the lung there. Well then, that didn't really go to plan, but we got it. I didn't even realize that guy was sitting up there. So, I thought I'd just sit here and wait for them to go to their drink zone, which I think is now what he's about to do. But then I just looked up and saw that. So we had, I think, sixes and sevens here. So I assume he's a respawn of one of them, but... Hi. You got here quick. I cannot brain shot these things today. There's another lion. I'm more interested in that, to be honest. How about you, uh, ignore me for a second? Kill that. Ow. Dang it, man. Alright, we got the things we wanted. So that was the five. I thought he could have been a blonde when he was laying in there, but... Since he did come out, he looked pretty much normal in the sevens, obviously not either, but... At least, you know, we found that other lion spot. I'm definitely going to check that out again. And yeah, we got a few more here for respawns. So nothing really too special here, but... Like I said, I'm just happy to, to find that uh, lion area. I think that's something I should focus on, maybe. Is some of those other zones, because... I don't know where those guys would drink. I don't think lions tend to drink here or here. You know, I had that one... Down along here somewhere, so they might they might drink down in that area. That'll have to be something I check into eventually, but yeah. That was a fun little hunt, just getting to check all that out again. And I think we're going to be back here tomorrow, because I'm going to do the 243 versus Warthog and Kudu, I think. So, we'll end up back on the Savannah for that. But uh, anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.